As a Christian, what would you say is the best way to dispel fear of intimacy for a single woman preparing for marriage after trauma? Healing, 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 healing is the name of the game. Because without that healing, um, it's so many things in between you and your husband. And the whole point of intimacy is oneness. And so healing helps you remove some of those barriers. Um, and it's a process. And you'll know when you're ready because God will put that man in your path. You all will be on the same page. It will not be like pulling teeth to be with that man. And I'm speaking from experience. Um, and this is why I don't teach from a place of pain. A lot of people who do what I do teach from pain. So all of their lessons will be, girl, you got to do this before you get married. Girl, you got to do that. And everything is from pain. But when you really trust God and you trust you and you know you and you've gotten healing, I don't need to teach you from a place of pain. And I'm teaching you from a place of I've made it over. I've overcome. I still have my, I still have my stuff, but I have gotten healing for a lot of my stuff. So that stuff is not in between my husband and I. Does that make sense? And a lot of that as Christians, now I can speak to you as a Christian because you say you're a Christian. As Christians, we have to let the Lord direct us and where we can go to get healing. Just because they say they're a man of God does 